While your main focus is to study at RMIT, you're also here to experience life in Melbourne, just like everyone else. Melbourne is a safe city, and in the latest Economic Intelligence Unit Livability Survey, Melbourne rated perfect scores for infrastructure, healthcare and education. But even with that said, it's still a busy place, and there are still many risks. RMIT's Safety in Australia website has simple, practical advice for you about staying safe. My top four tips for staying safe is to always stay aware of your surroundings, keep people you trust close by, reduce the risks where possible, ask for help or advice. For example, when traveling around Melbourne, stay alert around traffic. If you have headphones on, keep them at a low level so you can hear what's going on around you. Travel with people you trust and stay in well-lit public places. If you're lost or feeling unsafe, ask for help. When you're on campus, make sure you look after your valuables. Don't leave personal items unattended, even to go to the photocopier or while you take a study break. Keep your bag zipped up so people can't take your stuff when you're not looking. Australia is well known for its amazing beaches, rivers and pools. Avoid swimming alone and only enter the water when you know the local conditions. Beach lifeguards, campsite owners or town information officers can advise you. The Royal Life Saving website has tips on where to find the safest places to swim. It's also important to know about fire safety. Just remember, most fires occur in the home. The three most common causes of fire are cooking accidents, heaters and electrical faults such as overloading power boards. Smoke detectors are compulsory in all accommodation. Make sure you change your smoke detector battery once a year. You can visit the RMIT Safety in Australia website about campus and general information or you can find out more at the Metropolitan Fire Brigade website. Now let's take a break by getting out your mobile phone. Enter 99253333 and save it as RMIT Security Emergency Number. Now enter 99252051 and save it under RMIT General Security Inquiries. Anytime you're feeling unsafe or see something suspicious on campus, give them a call. Now, if you have an emergency, call 000 and ask for ambulance, police or fire, and then answer the questions about the nature of your emergency, giving your name and location. Remember, only phone 000 if it's an emergency. If you are taken to hospital in an ambulance or treated by a paramedic, your overseas health cover will meet the costs of the ambulance. Just keep in mind, Ambulance and fire brigade services may cost you many hundreds of dollars if it is a false alarm or a non-emergency. And finally, local police stations are open 24 hours a day, 7 days a week. Report any crimes to the police in your area. The Student Safety in Victoria brochure, issued by Victoria Police, can be downloaded on the RMIT security website. It's a lot to take in, but we want to make sure you get the most out of your time here at RMIT. If you have any questions regarding this Essentials Arrival video, make an appointment with a Student Wellbeing Advisor at the campus nearest to you, or email them at student.wellbeing at rmit.edu.au, or call them on 99252078. Always stay connected with RMIT by keeping up to date with the latest news, important dates, activities and student service events via My RMIT. You can also become a fan of RMIT on Facebook, follow RMIT on Twitter, or check out the RMIT YouTube channel. So welcome to RMIT. We're excited to have you here, and we hope you're excited to be here too. Remember, at RMIT, we're here for you.